good morning vlogmas day seven and we are waiting for brianna to come outside so that we can go to school morning everyone this is christmas 2000 and Oh my goodness, look how cute Brass is. Hello. What's today? Tax Saturday. That is adorable. Did you make that? That's so cute. Where's Bree? She's coming. Good morning, Marcy. Good morning, love. When it's 21 degrees outside, I look gray. But I love this. We are at Cassie's house because me and Brianna come over here every morning before, in between dropping Presley and her off because there's like a an, like 45 minute to an hour difference. So we come over here and chill for a little while. That way I don't have to make Brianna go to school super early because I know that'd be so annoying. Like I'd be so annoyed if I did that. We're about to leave. I think Cassie's gonna come over because my mom and Audrey are at home today and I'll be there so it'll be like a little girl's day. We're supposed to still be getting a lot of stuff done. I still have a ton of homework that I need to do because next week is my finals week. So this week is dead week. So I need to get a lot done. But I'll try and incorporate some fun stuff into it. Newt had surgery yesterday because of her lip. She had a tumor in her lip. Let's see, Newt. Just lift her top lip up. Okay. <laughs> you can't really see it, but it's okay. okay. We'll get it. It's later. okay, baby. Ah. So this is where she got spayed, obviously. <laughs> and then this is what her lip looks like. Hold on, baby. Baby goo. Fourteen. It looks I even worse in real life. Let me show oh, them what they, they did. Her. So basically, this is how her lip was. Her tumor was right here, so they cut this entire like scoop out. And so they had to bring this lip over to close it. So her lip was like this, basically. And it made it shorter so you can like see her teeth. But her lip is like stretched twice as far as it should be. It's oh, yeah. Botched. You can kind of tell that it's like super duper tight. So is it going like, like, to get better? It used to, her lip top or her bottom lip used to come up there. See how it's like pulled She's that way? such a good girl. Yeah. Look how you can literally tell. over here underneath her or her uh, Is it going to unstretch, Cassie? Is it going to? I hope. I, I would think it would stretch out. They called it reconstructive surgery. Yeah, you can oh, tell how tight it is. Okay, so I'm back home and I'm going to show you guys what I do when I'm really, really lazy in the morning and I don't want to wash my face. I just use these two products. This is Stridex for sensitive skin with aloe. Oh my god, my nose is running. Now my nose is all red because I just freaking blew it. Whatever. So yeah, these are the two products that I like to use. Neither of them I'm absolutely like, obsessed with. I actually do think that this Stridex helps a lot if you have oily skin, it helps kind of like dry out your skin just a little bit, but like not too much. And it also helps with acne for sure. I can tell a difference. My dermatologist actually recommended this to me a couple of years ago when I was going to the gym a lot and like sweating a ton. And I was starting to like get some acne like where I would sweat. And she said that after you get done working out, just use this. But now I just use it as like a replacement to washing my face. Which I don't know if it's the best thing ever or not. But I still do it. And then I also use this for my moisturizer just because I have it. I don't love it because it does have a scent to it. And I don't love products with scent. So this is the Shea Moisture Peace Rose Oil Complex for sensitive skin. It's a facial moisturizer with date palm and Camilla. Camellia? How do you say that? something extracts to soften and calm skin and I really like this brand Shea Moisture but this product I don't absolutely love I think it's because it has the rose oil in it and I actually have an oil by Pixie that I do like the smell of but I don't know I feel like when my skin is either like really dry or really irritated I don't want to put like something with that smells on my face because it kind of burns actually and I don't know if that's because of the oil or not but I feel like it's because of the like perfumey smell. Which one is so, the one that I don't like? That's the Pixie Rose Oil. So anyways, these the pads just look like this. I know that Neutro Neutrogena has pads like this as well that I've used before. And I think Clean and Clear does as well. But you just like rub it on your face. I should probably take this off. And I'm really lazy during the winter because it's so cold and I don't want to put... I don't want to wait for the water to get warm and I also don't want to like, I don't know, get my face wet. So 
I like to do this instead. The aloe in this makes your face feel like so fresh and like minty feeling almost. But then I just kind of like let it dry because it does kind of make your face a little damp. My nose is so red because I, because Cassie, I was at her house all day yesterday and she ran out of tissues and so I was using freaking toilet paper that was rough on my face. And I have a sensitive face so it like made it all raw right there. So now it burns. I just need to try like a different kind of this Shea Moisture moisturizer because I love the formula of it and like the consistency of the actual lotion. I just don't like the smell and it kind of burns on my skin. So I don't know if I'm just like allergic to it or what, but I'm going to use it until I'm out. And then for all y'all with allergies where your nose is like chapped and burning and hurting, Aquaphor, baby Aquaphor is my jam. Me and Audrey, um, well and Cassie, got it for our tattoos and now we use it for like everything so i could put that right there because ow it freaking hurts and the winter is like so harsh on my skin oh you know what it probably is it's my allergy medicine dries me out because dries me up because i uh take it to not make my nose all runny all the time because i'll literally be sitting here talking and then i can just like feel my nose start to run and i'm like oh ah! so i take that medicine and then that dries my skin out so there's just no air in the moisture either before. There's also no moisture in air. Oh my god, I'm gonna insert that clip on The Incredibles where he's like, I thought you could use the water in the air. There is no water in the air! You can't run on ice, I thought you could use the water in the air! There is no water in this air! Heaters like heat up the freaking moisture from the air. Like you can just like feel it in the air. The more you know. I'll insert that clip too. Before we pick Brown up, we am gonna hurry. Do you like my hair? What's oh yeah! Yeah, she got her roots done. I knew you'd appreciate it. Got it. <laughs> got it. <laughs> Easy a shock. Huh? Tell, tell everyone what you got. I'm like, Bleh. it's like a nice angle too. I got an unsweet tea with peach. I got a peach sprite. We're gonna get a green apple sprite, and Audrey got a diet Dr Pepper with vanilla. Scar is asleep right here, and I have the hiccups because I drink a drink of Audrey's Dr Pepper and it gave me hiccups. We should make a thumbnail right now. Okay. all these awards, nominated for all these awards. We're out of gas. 
Yeah, but it, it's okay. It sells two bars. If it was one bar, it'd be kind of sweet. It's literally 6 o'clock right now, and that's what time the movie starts. So we're not going to miss any of it. Woo! -hoo -hoo. Frantic. Let's run, mother. Audrey freaking lost the tickets right after we just got there. She lost them inside of her purse. I'm like, are you kidding? California. I want to go to the East Coast. I want to go where culture is, like How New York, world I race or at least snow. Connecticut or New Hampshire, no, where writers live in the get woods. Get into those schools anyway. What you do is very baller. It's very anarchist. Put the magazine back. <laughs> she has a big heart, your mom. She's warm, but she's also kind of scary. You can't be scary and warm. I think you can. Your mom is. So, you're not interested in any Catholic colleges? No way. I want schools like Yale, but not Yale because I probably couldn't get in. Highly recommend. What do you think, Mom? Highly recommend? Oh, yes. Mom cried. So good, I cried. Audrey, what do you think? The panic button on our vehicle doesn't work. What do you think? I thought it was amazing. Highly like, recommend. Oh my gosh, so good. 10 out of 10. Oh, and the seating is tough. Oh, oh, yes. Oh, my God. <laughs> the reclining cushy seats. I'm going to sit in the back, Mom. No. Yes, let me. Oh, oh you're so rude. It's 24 degrees outside. I'm freezing. And we have zero bars of gas. So we're right by 7 Eleven. <gasps> and then the light is green. Woo. See? Zero gas. Zero gas. No gas. Oh, and it's freaking cheap here, too. Why is gas so cheap in this town? Lady Bird was so good, guys. It's kind of inappropriate, so Jeff be like an adult if you watch it. But it's so good. Some are Wes Anderson's films, though. They can be inappropriate. Some of them, not all of them. Grand Budapest. Did you know, Mama, that that chick did an Ed Sheeran music video? No. Yeah. 